Introduction Hey Sunita, look at this chart. What can you observe from this chart? It depicts that human, chimpanzee, gorilla and other two animals possess some similarities and differences. Yes. What is the basis of these similarities and difference? Uh, they have a similar body structure. Not exactly, but the basis for similarities and differences is evolution of these animals from common life forms. Okay, do you want to say that this chart shows that human beings had chimpanzees as their ancestors? Chimpanzees' ancestors were gorillas and so on? Yes, let me explain to you in detail how various life forms were evolved on the earth, one after the other. Objectives At the end of this lesson, you will be able to Understand the Darwinian theory of evolution Understand the concept of natural selection Understand the concept of saltation Understand Hardy-Weinberg principle Know the various ancestors of Homo sapiens Biological Evolution Charles Darwin proposed two main concepts of elaborate biological evolution. 1. Branching Descent 2. Natural Selection Branching Descent The evolution takes place when more favorable population traits are passed on to generation. This is called Descent with Modification. Natural Selection The process whereby Organisms better adopted to their environment tend to survive and produce more offspring. Descent with modification Every population consists of individuals that are slightly different from one another. Variations that give individuals ability to survive long enough to successfully reproduce are more frequently passed to the next generation. Subsequently, these traits become more common and the population evolves. This is called as descent with modification. Evolution by descent with modification embodies two separate entities. A. Modification, that is, change with lineage. B. Branching, that is, different species share common ancestors. Natural Selection The process of natural selection involves four stages Variation, Differential Survival and Reproduction Inheritance, High Rate of Population Growth Natural Selection process is based on the following facts Natural resources are limited Population sizes are stable Members of population vary in characteristics most of the variations are inherited. Thus, the individuals having heritable variations that enable them to survive better in the competition for resources reproduce and leave more progeny than others. Hence, after a period of time, population characteristics changes and new forms arise. Example of Natural Selection Antibiotic resistant H. pylori have a mutation that results in the loss of information to produce an enzyme. This enzyme normally converts an antibiotic to a poison which causes death. But when the antibiotics are applied to the mutant H. pylori, these bacteria can live while the normal bacteria are killed. So, by natural selection, the one that lost information survives and pass this trait along to their offspring. Mechanism of Evolution Hugo de Ries proposed the mutation that is, large differences arising suddenly in a population causes evolution. These mutations are random and directionless. 
such mutations cause speciation and hence are called saltation that is single step large mutations hardy weinberg principle hardy weinberg principle says that the le frequencies in a population are stable and constant from generation to generation the total number of genes and their alleles that is gene pool in a population remains constant this is referred to as genetic equilibrium some total of all allelic frequencies is one this gives hardy weinberg equilibrium equation as shown below disturbance in genetic equilibrium or hardy weinberg equilibrium that is change of frequency of alleles in a population results in evolution factors affecting hardy weinberg equilibrium the following five factors affect hardy weinberg principle number 1 gene flow number 2 genetic drift number 3 mutation number 4 genetic recombination number 5 natural selection gene flow when migration of a section of population occurs to another place gene frequencies change in the original as well as in the new population new genes alleles are added to the new population and these are lost from the old population when such migration occurs many times it results in gene flow genetic drift when genetic migration occurs by chance it is termed as genetic drift such original drifted population becomes the founder of formation of new species and this is termed as founder effect mutation variation due to mutation results in changed frequencies of genes and alleles in future generation genetic recombination variation due to recombination also results in changed gene frequency in future generation effect of natural selection on hardy weinberg equilibrium natural selection is a process in which heritable variations enabling better survival are enabled to reproduce and leave greater number of progeny natural selection can result in the following conditions in a population stabilization in this condition more individuals acquire mean character value directional change in this condition more individuals acquire values other than the mean character value disruption in this condition more individuals acquire peripheral character value evolutionary history the first cellular life form appeared on the earth about 2000 million years ago mya some of these cells released oxygen by a process similar to photosynthesis gradually multicellular forms evolved from single celled organisms further evolution can be traced as follows evolution of mammals the first mammals to evolve were shrew like mammals mammals took over the earth when reptiles came down some mammals lived wholly in water example whales dolphins sea cows etc mammals were viviparous and protected their unborn young inside the mother's body mammals were more intelligent in sensing and avoiding danger than other animals evolution of man man with complete language skills and self consciousness evolved in the following stages dryopithecus are the primates that existed 
at around 15 million years ago. Ape-like Ramapethicus are the primates that existed at around 15 million years ago. Man-like walked upright and were about 4 feet tall. Australopithecines existed at around 2 million years ago in East Africa grasslands. First human-like beings called Homo habilis. Brain capacity was 650 to 800 cc. Homo erectus existed around 1.5 million years ago with large brain of size 900 cc. 8 meat. Nenderthal man with brain size of 1400 cc lived near East and Central Asia around 1 lakh to 40,000 years back. Homo sapiens evolved in Africa around 75,000 to 10,000 years ago, called the modern man. Did you know? Human evolution has now entered a new phase where genetic engineering allows parents to design their own children. As a result, our DNA can be modified to make future generations stronger, smarter and more resistant to disease. Summary let us summarize what we have learned. Charles Darwin proposed two main concepts of elaborate biological evolution, branching descent and natural selection. Hugo de Ries proposed that mutation, that is, large differences arising suddenly in a population, causes evolution. Hardy Weinberg principle says that allele frequencies in a population are stable and is constant from generation to generation. The first cellular life form appeared on Earth about 2000 million years ago. The first mammals to evolve were shrew-like mammals. Homo sapiens evolved around 75,000 to 1,000 years ago.